How's it going guys? Welcome back to another episode of Ashton's Trader Joe's Wine and Spirit Review. Today I have Trader Joe's Special Reserve Irish Whiskey. Yes. It is uh, $15.99 in California. And like I always say, it might be a little bit more or less, depending on where you're from. Um, let's see what it has to say on the back. Trader Joe's Special Reserve Irish Whiskey comes from an Irish whiskey making family dedicated to crafting high quality whiskey since the 18th century. Their focus is on restoring the ancient distilling techniques of Irish whiskey. This Special Reserve bottling consists of only the best casks of grain and malt whiskey. This, uh, specially selected for their quality, producing a smooth yet flavorsome Irish whiskey of distinct quality. Oh man, it always sounds so good on the back, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, so from what I know about this, um, it's, uh, it's just a basic Irish whiskey blend. Uh, it's triple distilled. Uh, and the cool fact about this actually is that let's say about, let's say with Jameson, right? So the malt is uh, triple distilled. The rest of it is column still. Corn or I think it's, I'm pretty sure it's all corn or Jameson. I'm not hundred percent sure. So it's a blend of basically um, barley, triple distilled in a pot still, and then corn, uh, column still, and then they blend together. This, the grain in this is actually triple distilled as well. So this is 100% pot still whiskey. Fun fact, um, I've tasted it before. Um, I can't find where, um, I can't find where exactly it came from. Um, I just have a hunch that it's Bushmills. I really do. Uh, it just kind of has a Bushmill vibe going for it. So yeah, let's get into it. No age statement. So I'm guessing 99.99% of this is gonna be three years old. Ex-bourbon casks. Let's go for the See how it is. Again. I don't know if you know this about me, but I actually, my favorite type of whiskey is Irish whiskey. Um, oh Already spilling. Always spilling. Yeah, again, that classic biscuity note. A little bit of vanilla. It's like a, a sweet vanilla. This is, this is, this is sweet. I mean, it's not sweet, sweet, but it's sweeter than JMO. There we go again. God. All right, I'm not gonna spill anymore. This is the last time I'm gonna spill. Filled it up a little too high. It's a tiny little, oh God. Mild oak. Yeah, just classic blended Irish. I'm getting a little bit more sweetness than in Jameson. And, um, I'm thinking maybe because the corn was, uh, the grain was pot still. Yeah, not much to it. Just classic biscuity notes. You're getting, uh, I'm getting some vanilla in there, like a sweet vanilla in there. Oaky notes, of course. All right, it's going for, uh, it's going for the palate. It's just a classic Irish whiskey. I have a hunch this is from Bushmills for sure. It's gotta be, it's really gotta be Bushmills. Get the floral notes in there, biscuity notes. Yeah, it, it almost tastes like a hybrid of Jameson whiskey, Bushmill whiskey, blending together with just a tad bit more sweetness. That's, that's what this tastes like to me. Yeah, I mean, it's really not that bad. I mean, for $15.99, uh, like I said, this is the type of bottle. Am I enjoying it? Yes. Am I gonna buy it again? No. Uh, if someone had it at their house and they said, hey, you wanna want a little bit of this whiskey? I'd say, absolutely, pour me, pour me a drum. But uh, it's very light, very floral. 
God, it just smells. It smells like the bush smells, really. Uh, I could be wrong. I really could. If you know who uh, who distills this, leave it in the comments because I'd love to know. I can't find it anywhere. Yeah, just a basic Irish whiskey. Not much to it. Classic biscuit. Uh, floral on the nose. You know, vanilla. It's almost like a sweet vanilla. Some oak. Um, not getting a lot of like the metallic taste I get with Jameson, but it's another reason why I think it's Bushmills because I don't get much metallic in Bushmills. That's just me. Some people do, I don't. Getting a little bit of malty funkiness actually. No, no, no. A little bit of malt funk, I like to call it. Very subtle. <sighs> Easy to drink. It's just one of those classic Irish. You might as well. You, know, you see, you go to Trader Joe's and you get you see Jameson, and um, Trader Joe's has like the the one liter Jameson for uh, twenty four ninety nine in California. Uh, this is fifteen ninety nine. You might as well just grab this. Give it a shot. You might like it more than me. But uh, before we go, let's try it on the rocks. I mean, it, oh, it is 40%. It's 80 proof. Uh, and on the lightness, is there color added? Even though it's really light, sometimes you're like, why don't, if they're gonna use color, why don't, why don't they just use it? Why don't they just make it dark? But realistically, you know, three years uh, in an ex bourbon barrel, in Ireland, which is cold all year round. This is gonna be, what, maybe like a cast strength of five years would look like. So, I mean, I would imagine there's coloring, in, unless it's maybe second fill, which I highly doubt it. It's probably, it's probably old bourbon barrels. Yeah, let's try the rocks before we go. Usually don't like to try uh, 80 proof whiskey on the rocks, but you guys might want to, so I, I, I gotta do it. Let's just go into it. Let's just, let's just go for it. This lighter doesn't really bring much flavor out. I mean, it's already watered down so much. So yeah. So yeah, anyway, not bad. Don't worry, I will drink this. There's no wasting in this house. Trader Joe's Special Reserve Irish Whiskey. Pretty damn good. $15.99 in California. Maybe more, I don't know how to say that. Give it a shot, it's not bad. Twist off, all pot distilled, no column still in this. Uh, green bottle, typical Irish. That's really not that bad. I'm gonna be drinking this tonight, that's for sure. All right, you guys have a good one. Don't forget to subscribe, like, leave a comment if you like. Let me know if there's um, anything you want me to try in Trader Joe's. And uh, I've actually come to the conclusion, maybe I might be trying some other things that are uh, that's not in Trader Joe's, but that's gonna be like three to 5% of my videos. Cause I just wanna stick to Trader Joe's, that's my channel. But uh, there's only really so much that comes in so uh, if you want me to try something, just let me know. Leave it in the comments, and I'll try it. I'll buy it, I'll try it. So yeah, you guys have a great night. Thank you much.